Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another very exciting video here at Glance at Games and today I proudly present to you Sleeping Dogs. You can already hear guys, I'm very excited to bring you back to Hong Kong because also for me it has been quite some time since we were here. So let's start with our first mission today and I would say we bring back the Jade Statue. Practice the grapple finisher on the student. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, that is gnarly. So we bring him into the stun state and then... Holy shit! Oh my god. I mean, Sifu, this cannot be in your interest, right? That is so aggressive. Did you see how hard we hit him? He almost shifted into another dimension. All right, but good training. We are going to continue with our kidnapping lead. This is right here. There's our new lead, kidnapper lead number three. Katushka, I will show you the way to freedom. I might not sit on a white stallion here, but at least I'm on a motorcycle. Meet Eliana near the docks. All right. Oh, she's also a motorcycle rider. Now I'm going to put a tracking device on you. I should be able to follow you wherever you go. Oh, there's not a lot of place to hide it. I mean, look at that. You don't have to worry anymore because I am here. Ah, there is the pig from the casino boat. Oh, yeah, we'll sort that out. Come on, honey. Photo the kidnapper with Iliana. Yes. And there he goes. Perfect back shot. Yeah, Iliana is not the only one who is getting back shots. All right, take Iliana's motorcycle. One minute remaining? What? Oh, shit. Okay, let's go. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, faster. It's basically checkpoint driving with a time limit. Ooh, ooh. Close to property damage. Get a boat. Oh, they didn't arrive at the meeting point. Okay, I see, I see. Eliana, where are you? Oh, a tunnel. Okay, so then let's swim inside. That is not just Eliana. There are already four women. Oh no, bad guys coming. Yeah, come down, come down. Thank you. Oh, and there's a briefcase. Let's try to remember that for later. But first of all... Nice flip. Oh, behind me. Get up. Stand up. Stand up for your shot. He was hiding for very long there. Holy shit. Can you get us out of here? Maybe. Give me a second. What do you mean with maybe? Of course we are getting her out. And the others too. Wei is the most decent gangster I know. I told you he would save us. Remember the name, Miliana and Katushka. We snatched up Fisherman Lai and his entire gang. Plus 22 women they were holding in two other locations. Keep safe, Wei. Good luck. Oh, wow. Case closed. Complete all cases. We did everything. But what a way to end our case streak here. This was basically our last mission for forever, I think. All right, there you go. Do you see what kind of entrance I can make here? Boom. And $10,000. Mm, this is exactly what I need. Yeah, but what a nice way to celebrate our last case for Inspector Tang. But that also means that we can continue with our triad mission. Bad luck. Tu Jin must go. Dan Hai, he must not be removed by force. He is an immensely superstitious man, obsessed with feng shui. Think it is pronounced feng shui? I've never heard that before. Feng shui. Hey, Make but the sure more you know, right? Oh, that guy lives in a gated community. I mean, with all that money that he probably has, no wonder. But now we have to mess with his Feng Shui. Oh, this is going to be a very interesting mission. Let's see what happens. Find a way inside the gated community. Yeah, we can do that. But first of all, use the health shrine for good omens. Because when we are messing with Feng Shui, we should keep ours in balance. Use the intercom to get inside the building. Who's this? We got a delivery for you. Really? My husband didn't tell me. He better not have ordered something stupid from the internet again. And easy as that. No concierge whatsoever. I mean, that intercom really messes with the reason why people live in a gated community. But hey, easier for us, am I right? Oh, that guy is yapping so much. I mean, he is talking about massages, which is a topic that we are quite familiar with. I mean, we can talk about massages later as a reward or something. And open sesame. Smash the collectibles so that only four remain. And yeah. yeah, those vases are probably very expensive. Steal the lucky collectible. Wait a second, is that the statue? That is indeed our statue that we need. Nice. Our Sifu will be very pleased. Wait, wait, wait. Set the time 444 and unplug it. That'll freak him out. That is a messed up humor, but hey, let's adjust the clock. Mr. Chow, is that you? Go away. Anybody in there? 
No, it's just a dog. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. All right, let's erase the video footage. And there we go. Hackerman. Oh, so his little gambling tour was a complete failure. And now he's seeing that. Uh-oh. Heads will roll. Oh. But we made it. Woo. See you later, kid. Wait, and you're leaving me in the rain? You're not even taking me to the next corner or to the golden koi? Hey, maybe I'm hungry too. And we only got $500 for that? $500? Are you kidding me? How are you? Uncle Poe. He's dead. No! Oh, come on. I'll be in touch. Of course. Whatever you need. Oh, that is hitting me. We are not getting food and now we are not even having Uncle Poe anymore. All right, guys, but I think I need something now as a little reward and also as a way to distract myself from this very devastating message. I'm looking for a cockfight. I'm looking for a cockfight where I have to keep my pants on because the last time, well, let's say it didn't really go the way as it has been planned. But I heard from a very rewarding alternative here at the harbor, so let's check that out. I never thought I would ask an adult man to show me his cocks, plural, but hey, here we are. All right, so we have Chow Dai, Kala Road Island Leghorn, and we have Lang Quan. Crow Langshaw wins four, wins zero. Guys, do we want to bet on the underdog? On the undercock? Place 50,000. Okay, let's go. Let's see who is going to win. Come on, little fella. Destroy him. Oh, this is intense. Put on the black bars, guys. A fight is going to happen. No! Our fighter died. No! $50,000 down the drain. Our undercock. What a disappointment. <laughs> we can bury him right next to Uncle Poe now. <laughs> yeah, well, that was a failure. But I saw right there on the right hand side, there's a fighting possibility. And I bet we are getting a lot of money. And since I need to release a bit of steam, this might be the perfect place to be at right now. Also get a bucket because a lot of teeth are going to fly around. Evade. Nope. Oh my, oh, oh, oh. did you see that new move there? Don't you see that I am dangerous? I'm wearing sunglasses at night. Say goodbye to your spine. Okay, how many rounds do we have to fight? I didn't really pay attention. So this is number three out of six. Okay. Nope. You know I'm the counter master. Somebody get me the bucket. Teeth are flying. I repeat, teeth are flying. Oh, the first grappler. So now things are getting a bit more complicated. Yes, and escape. Perfect conditions. You definitely imagined your evening a bit different, I know, but hey, I got a lot of steam and enough to deal with all of you. Oh, <laughs> I love that you move. I don't know why, but it reminds me a bit of A-Train in the first season when he slammed Kimiko's head into the wall or into the ground. That was so gnarly. It is already early morning. We've been fighting for hours here. So it's just a matter of condition here. Condition, stamina, staying concentrated, kicking as many people as I can. Oh my God, I used an iframe. Did you see that? Nobody's killing the Crimson Raider. Martial Arts Club complete! Seriously, that's the best you can do. Wei Shen, Wei Shen, Wei Shen. Let's fucking go. $60,000 and Hock Pen Row outfit. That sounds very interesting. We're going to try this as soon as we can when we're heading home. Oh, that looks fire. Hock Pen, Hock Row. Okay, maybe I'm slaughtering the pronunciation here. Sorry, guys. Yes, this is definitely a keeper. And that is also the perfect outfit, guys, to bring back the other jade statue that we got from the house invasion. I found one of your statues. The ox. You have done well. Practice the arm break on the student. Oh my god, bro. A second time? Uh, Sifu, you are allowed to intervene, right? That is so gnarly. Okay, let's take you out first and then bring you to the hospital because your arm has been broken twice now. <laughs> I don't know why I'm always laughing when I'm seeing that, but holy shit, we are becoming a fighting machine. Enough about training and punching students into a coma. I think we have more important things to handle, like conflicted loyalties. You know Big Smile Lee? Oh yeah. 
We've crossed paths. We've got a joint venture making porn. Oh, great. Yeah, the guy that is like involved in the killing of Winston is doing porn now. This is exactly the kind of news that I want to hear, not. Here's the address. There's a box of stuff over by the elevator. Go to the apartment building. Wait a second. Now we are degraded to a career boy? On second thought, give the bitch the full treatment. Hack her computer, bug the place, then plant the cameras. I would say, let's go. Give her the full treatment, all inclusive packet way shan style. I'm a location scout. Could you let me have a look around? Only residents and their guests are allowed, sir. You have to leave the premises, sir. <clears throat> Oh, we cannot attack him? Are you kidding me? Don't hurt the doorman? Wait a second. I can run over innocent people in my missions. I can shoot people on my missions, but I cannot hurt the doorman. This is where the game draws the line. All right, then. Climb up to the open window. There's the entrance. That is pretty high. Why are there chicken here? Are you having your own personal fight? And didn't I see you die? Did you get resurrected like Jesus? Now I'm fighting pissing homeless people all of a sudden. This is basically the ordinary day experience in San Francisco. But I do not want to do that. I want to stay urine free. Oh, and I think this is our last shrine. Is it our last shrine, guys? Max health increased by 10%. Nice. We are getting stronger by the minute. Our health stats, very good. Yeah, luckily in Hong Kong, nobody is closing their doors behind them. So it is easy entering. Oh. That wasn't planned and I hope nobody's going to notice that. Everything requires hacking in this game, even copying simple files. Yeah, almost got it, almost got it. Yes, but calibrated. And now hide upstairs. I almost ran into the wine bottles. And easy escape. Meet Andrew at the rendezvous. I'm coming and I'm on the way. What about Sunny Wo? Anything new there? What about Jackie, huh? Fuck, Pendrew, are you deaf? No, Officer Shane, I'm not. But you clearly have forgotten who you're speaking to. Yeah, that is true. He is still our Wait. superior in command, even Forget if we don't like it. Sonny had me put up a hidden camera in Vivian Lou's bedroom. Think you could get a copy of that? This could be the piece that we're missing on Sonny. But I want Jackie in return. Cut him loose. Get me the video and he walks. I'll get it. But in all honesty, guys, this deal is going to backfire immensely. Pendrew is not somebody that you can trust. We know that now. What are you doing here? Well, Sonny says you've been really helpful to him. And I just wanted to thank you. Oh, Vivian. Oh, come on. Leave my pork bun alone. Wait, Sonny sent you here? Yeah, don't you know that... Know what? I can't do it anymore. Sonny will just... Wait, Sonny is sending his girlfriend to other people's houses to thank them by giving them the allowance to sleep with his girlfriend? What a fucked up guy. But hey, Wei Shen is staying a gentleman. I mean, in the last episode, we had sex on a rooftop with Ileana, but that is besides the point. Wei, did you bring the video? And Jackie? Done. Oh, wait, what does that mean? Poor choice of words here. I can't come in now. I'm not finished yet. Those are my orders. Fuck your orders and fuck you too, Penju. I came on to take down the sun on you, not to shuffle the deck. Yes! Wait, Shen, wait, Shen. Hashtag fuck Penju's in the comment section. Your friend Jackie has agreed he'll be walking out of jail in a few minutes. Just thought you might want to be there to pick him up. Oh, that is a great outfit, don't you think, guys? Oh, yes, we definitely look like a motherfucker. My feet hurt. I keep telling you to get new shoes, but you never listen. You always say I need shoes, then always complain when I want shoes. Pick one! Oh, here we go again. I better release you from that burden. <laughs> I'm doing you a favor. You may not know it yet, but when you wake up from your coma, you will definitely realize it. All right, so now that we have taken care of the necessities, I think it is time to attend the funeral. But before that, we have to look for one of the shops downtown that sells us a suit and tie, because we cannot get to a funeral with a tank top and gold chains. So let's head to the city and let's look for something. Light gray classic elegance now with stain resistance. That sounds very good, especially when we are in a fight again, so the blood is just curling off. You joking? Of course I'm gonna pick you up. You're my boy. My boy. Hey, Jackie Ma. Jackie is yeah. my boy. You get it? Some lady cop wanted me to turn snitch. Tang something or another. Oh, so as soon as Tang is finished with us, she's okay, already right? recruiting somebody else. Ah, okay, I see how this goes. I thought we had something special, Tang. <laughs> I look like shit. I need a suit or something. We'll pick something up. Oh, I didn't notice the other arm I was about to say. Is he doing a very German greeting there? Oh, that is fine. Oh, do you see the belt? Sheesh.
Jeez. Yeah, this is definitely something that I can wear at a funeral. Might be time for me to make a change. Maybe all that talk about being a big deal was just... Oh, so Jackie is really talking about looking for another life perspective. I mean, good for him. Spending time in the triads might be a very intense job experience, I would say. But for a long-term perspective, especially when he's looking for a girlfriend or family, maybe do something ordinary. There is no shame in taking a 9-to-5. Goodbye, Uncle Poe. All the things that we have been through, I can't remember them like they were yesterday. And there's 18k, I suppose. What the fuck are the 18k doing here? I was about to ask the same, by the way. I mean, isn't that a close ceremony? I've been looking forward to this moment for a long time. Let's go, boys. We got what we came for. We're leaving. The 18k are about to do this city a great public service. And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get. Oh, what? He's turning his He's back on us? He's leaving us? Oh, you bitch. So these motherfuckers wouldn't be to be sent on ye! All right, let's get fucking. I will use the dead bodies of my enemies as cover. Bring the body bags, guys. Bring the body bags. Ah! Bye. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, my God. Big shot. Holy shit. Yeah, but very sus that the auto aim instantly locked on his dick. A new tuber? Not on my cemetery. Yeah, hold still. Hey, hold that for me. Holy shit. <laughs> Okay, I didn't expect these kind of physics. What the fuck? Why are they all so jumpy? Oh, you're gonna eat. You're gonna eat. Munch on that. <laughs> Let's go. And you are so close together. I am sorry. I am very sorry. <laughs> Maybe I'm not. I feel like SEAL Team 6 here. All right, advance, advance. Oh, that feels so good. Show me your head. Show me your head. Show me your pork bun. Thank you. I mean, $5,000 is fine. Tried experience level 7, funeral suit. I like the benefits. I like what I got here from the mission. But we have to get back to the cemetery. There it is. I need to get in there. Oh my god. Statue collectible found and let's bring that back to our... Get out of the way. Let's bring that back to the Sifu. Yeah, thanks for lending me your motorcycle. And we made it. All statues back in the shelf. And now we are able to unlock the last and the most powerful move of them all. Oh my god, what kind of combo is that? Alright, get over here. Oh, that is nice. Machine gun blow. <laughs> and he's getting the knee. <laughs> Been a pleasure to work with a student as skilled as you. Do you see what we have become? We are the martial arts expert. And I think we can roll over all the remaining 18Ks in the next episode because we are making a cut here. We have been through a lot today. Thank you very much for tuning in. If you like this video, then be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and also ring the bell to never miss out on future content here at Blancet Games. And as always, stay safe, play fair and keep gaming. This is Glancet Games. Over and out.